Hey there everyone, welcome to Technoholic. In this video, we will talk about how one can research and create complete presentation within few minutes using ChatGPT and Office. And we're going to show you using free version and paid version as well. So without further ado, let's get started. Okay, so here you can see I already have opened ChatGPT.com. If you have not created any account in ChatGPT, in that case, what we need to do is you simply need to visit chat.openai.com and here it will ask you to sign up you can click on sign up and then based on your preference you can sign up using google microsoft and apple now let me close this and here as i said that i will start this with free version so instead of 4.0 i will go with gpt 3.5 now let me give it a topic so let's say we need to work on a topic which is impact of technology in our society. So let me actually ask ChatGPT to create a whole presentation on it. I want to create presentation on following topic impact of technology in our society. Please generate complete presentation of 20 to 25 pages slides with proper introduction and conclusion. And then I would say sometimes it's up to us. We always can fine tune to specifics. So you can always ask ChatGPT that, you know, you want to focus on that particular topic inside technological impact in our society. So since I would like to create this general presentation, so I think we are good to go. Now let me click here on this button, submit. And there we go guys we can see that our slides are kind of ready now i'm gonna also ask gpt if it can generate the whole presentation by itself can you generate the complete presentation by yourself in ppt format and let's see so since we are using this free variant so this one is not capable of giving us ppt file but here what we can do is we can slightly optimize it. Please remove slide number from the slide. For example, I do not need slide one, slide two, text written on heading. Also, I would like you to add little description on these subheadings that we have created. Now let's see what happened. And there we go. Here we can see the further optimized variant of same. Now, uh, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to copy this whole text and then uh, I'm going to open office.com. Okay. And believe me, guys, we will not take too much of time. So office.com again, I would say is completely free. If you do not have account in office.com, then again, it is pretty easy to create. Simply need to type office.com on URL and then here you can sign in and can create your new account. Account creation again, I would say is completely free. After creating your account in office.com, we need to click here on create and need to go to document. Now simply we need to paste the content that we have copied. And then if you want, we can make slight changes. Now after that, we need to click here on file and then click on export. And from here, we need to choose this option, which is export to PowerPoint presentation. Now here the office AI is capable enough to understand this whole presentation. Now what I'm going to do here is I can actually choose the suitable template uh, or theme based on my requirement. Let's say I would like to go with this one so I can choose this and then let's click OK. Now let's wait for a while. And in this way, guys, we have created this whole presentation utilizing OpenAI and Microsoft Office. Now, sometime, you know, we require different images. In that case, what we can do is we can utilize smart search. For example, I want to add here image which signify transformative role of technology. I can select this text and then I can make a right click. And then here we will find this option, which is smart search. Let's click on it. And this way, actually, uh, we can get, you know, suitable image and we can directly import that within a click inside our PPT. And then, um, you know, you can also filter out if you only want creative common only or you want to add another image to your presentation. But make sure you need to keep in mind that if you uncheck this option, 
then these images might be subjected to copyright use. So in this way guys, we can research and can create complete presentation within few minutes using ChatGPT and Office.com AI. And then we also have further customization option, for example, smart search that we have seen. And then there is this PowerPoint designer option, which is, I would say, great if you would like to change look and appeal of the content. Now let's talk about the paid version. Okay. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to close everything. Now we are back here in chatgpt.com and this time let's use this plus version of chatgpt and let me this time ask chatgpt to generate complete ppt. And there we go. Here we can see GPT has started creating complete PowerPoint file and it is available for download so let me open it up and there we go here we can see gpt has created this whole presentation by itself and then we can utilize designer to add suitable image to it and then um, you know sometimes you will also get this presentation in 4 ratio 3 format which always we can change by going to design tab and then slide size from here i can select 16 ratio 9 and now again um, you know we can go back here in designer so if you are not using 365 you may not find designer again in that case you can upload this to office.com and there in even in free version you will find the designer option is available so in this way guys we can create presentation using paid version so what do you think about these both methods that we have discussed in this video do you like the paid version or free version more please do let us know in comment down below and i will catch you soon with one such another video till then you take care and bye bye